Greg Lee. Thanks for joining us for another edition of Made in Riverside. But tonight, they're here rehearsing for the Festival of Light. Diseases such as the West Nile virus. Until recently, city mosquito control was undertaken by the city's public purchase. I fell in love with Greg's personality. He was always hosting events. He was always involved in the community. He just talks to everybody and knows everybody. I'm in the business of talking to people. They said I could do it with ease. They said he came natural. I think it's a gift. He really brings people together. Greg and I became engaged in 2014 in Oahu, Hawaii. We were so much in love. In September of 2015, Greg started to develop flu-like symptoms, and I ended up taking him to the emergency room. Greg presented with nonspecific symptoms. He had some nausea, some vomiting. He then developed a condition known as hydrocephalus, and that's swelling of the brain, and that can quickly cause damage to the brain and permanent injury. They ended up um, inducing him into a coma. When Greg arrived, he had been diagnosed with West Nile virus, and we confirmed that diagnosis. Our team quickly realized that he was going to need the expertise of many different areas. He was soon seen by our intensive care physicians, our infectious disease specialist, our cardiologist, our neurologist. He's um, the most severe West Nile encephalitis patient that we've seen. He then developed cardiac arrest and respiratory failure. I remember the care team at Kaiser Permanente being very aggressive with their care, being very open to letting us know what was going on. Knowing that really takes a burden off of you. Our entire team came together to surround Greg with all of the specialty knowledge that was needed to get him through this hospitalization. All of those specialists communicating with one another seamlessly depended on our integrated system of care. Dr. Dow started to build a sense of clarity. He knew that there was potential to move forward. Woke up, like, where am I? Why am I like this? My legs couldn't move, I couldn't walk. The only thing that was moving was his eye. And I can see that little spark in his eye, that something there, something that we're fighting for. He's just one of a kind. <laughs> There's no one like Greg. Greg basically had to start from scratch. He had to relearn how to eat, how to talk, and now walk. He started regaining his upper body strength. It's his bicep, his tricep. I have a great care team around me. Dr. Tom has always been there for me. Kaiser Permanente has always been there for me. They brought me back to life. Dr. Dow is one of our guardian angels throughout this whole process. He just genuinely cares about Greg and his recovery. Hard work, patience, and faith. Faith that this will end. To see him continue with that attitude of determination is something that I can't describe. It just, it makes me very proud. Greg's taking the initiative to start planning our wedding again. Walking Gina down the aisle. Look for, for the moment. This whole experience has been for me. But I keep going. That's the only way. Keep going. This too shall pass. <laughs>